How many hours of training do you think are needed to become a cosmetologist in New York State? Would you believe a thousand? That's why a group of high school students trade summer break for styling hair, giving manicures, and providing skin care through a program at Capital Region BOCES. It's really hard work. You're on your feet the entire time. And it's difficult. It's difficult. It's very physical. And you need to be able to communicate with your client. And sometimes you get clients, you know, that can be difficult. And it's a whole package that they need to be able to be successful in. In the BOCES program, students learn what they need to know to pass state licensing exams. The students are taught theory in the classroom and gain hands-on experience in the program's clinic, which is open to members of the community. Like after like my third or fourth haircut, I knew that I was going to be able to do it because I just had to keep trying to do it. My grandma and my aunt were both actually cosmetologists and they went to another different school and everything and they both loved it and so that kind of drew me in a little bit and also some of the former students that went to my school they always talked about and they had their mannequin heads with all the different cool things and I'm like that looks like so much fun so I had to try it and I ended up really loving it like from the first day I really enjoyed it. Graduates of the program have landed positions in high-end salons and pursued opportunities to work as makeup artists for Hollywood studios. Students say the BOCES cosmetology program is demanding but rewarding. Doing hair makes people feel better about themselves and makes me feel better to help others with their hair, make them look better if they feel like they don't look good. Reporting for NISBA News, I'm Casey Nicholson. And on November 7th, be sure to tune in and see how the Avon CSD has converted 100% to solar energy. Their new array features seven and a half acres of solar panels.